Well, good evening. We're here at Slate on Sand Lake Road for Magical Dining Night Number Three. Um, this is the only non-Disney property restaurant that we picked. Um, so let's go inside and see what they have to offer us. So just a little bit about the restaurant. It's open kitchen, which is also fabulous. Um, beautiful gas chandeliers throughout. They're so pretty. Probably one of my favorite things. Um, smaller restaurant, but still the atmosphere is amazing here with the open bar on the side. And then we are sitting in the patio area. It's completely closed in, but it does have doors that they could open up. And look at those fans. Those fans are kind of cool as well. Late. This is their magical dining menu. I'm going to go ahead and put a photo in it um, so you guys can see it a little bit better. But I think I'm going to go with the grilled romaine salad, the steak, obviously, and the key lime bar is going to be my um, choices for this evening at Slate. Um, they also have happy hour from on Mondays, which is kind of fun from 6 p.m. until close. And then every other day of the week, it is from 4 to 6.30 p.m. These are some of their house specialties, cocktails, local drafts, wine by the glass. And also, I'm going to go ahead and put in a still of the main menu. Um, they don't have tuna tartare, kinda sad tonight. That's all right, guys. I will um, be trying the magical dining and get that romaine salad we might um and i think the missus is gonna get the um fried green tomato here are the beverages as well um you have any questions please so if you guys want to So we have the deviled eggs. Guys, they're pink. That's awesome. They look delicious. Tonight's drinks are very basic. Basic Coke, basic Cosmo. All right, we have the grilled romaine salad. That looks so yummy. And the uh, fried green tomatoes. So we're gonna eat these up and see how they are. I would say that those appetizers were successfully bowl liquors. That salad, the romaine, grilled romaine salad was the best. Although the missus begs to differ and she's more partial to the fried green tomatoes. I tasted both and I still say salad over fried green tomatoes. So I have the steak, medium rare. She has the shrimp carbonara. Shrimp? Shrimp carbonara. These green beans are everything. <laughs> You like a crisp green bean. I do. Alright, crazy, whatever. Nice. Do you do that too? <laughs> Just you too. Alright, what it's is like it? It's like a chocolate terrine, I think is what it was called. And it has like roasted peanuts and, and a raspberry coolie. Coolie. <laughs> which we have now determined is definitely like this pureed, the like puree raspberry. stuff that you've already dug into. <laughs> Whatever, I've already started trying to eat it before you recorded it. This is the key lime bar, and it looks amazing. I hope you enjoyed watching our dinner at Slate for Magical Dining Month. Um, just so you guys have a little bit of background about Magical Dining Month, 
Um, you can go to visitorlando.com. There is a list of all of the restaurants that are participating, and part of those proceeds go to different local charities in the Orlando area. So just a basic review on our meal tonight. Sorry guys, it was way dark when we left the restaurant, and I could not get any video footage. Um, and I tried, I promise. So, after some mosquito bites, we decided to call it quits, and I'd come home and do the review here in my cozy seat. So, let's get to it, shall we? So, the bowl liquor of the night was definitely the deviled eggs. Those pink little chickens were delicious. So, the wifey and I were trying to decide how did they get them pink? Did they just food color dye them? Did they dye them with beets? We don't know. We don't care. They were yum. So then I had the grilled romaine salad, which to me was so delicious. And um, almost a bowl of liquor had that potential. Um, but the, the eggs definitely beat it out. And it could be that the eggs beat it out because of the creativity of the pink. Now, for my steak entree, medium rare, cooked to perfection, seasoned with such delight. Um, I could have gone without the green beans. I'm not a crispy green bean lover, um, but my wife, as you could see, definitely likes a crispy green bean. And the potatoes were very heavy as well. So by the time we got to the potatoes and the meat and the potatoes of it all, I was a little full. Plus, I had dessert coming. So that key lime bar was delicious. Perfect ratio of key lime to crust. And that's what makes a perfect key lime pie or bar. Now the missus, she had those fried green tomatoes. We couldn't quite figure out what that sauce was. It was very good for her. I'm not the biggest fan of that one. I've had better fried green tomatoes. Her shrimp cabanero. I can't ever say that. Cabanero, 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 she says, cabanero, she says it so easily. Anyways, oh, sorry, itches. So, cabanero was very tasty. The pasta was very good. Um, the sauce was delightful. I loved that sauce. Um, I probably could have just taken that sauce all day long and eaten it. Um... And so it was very, very, very good. Then she had a semi-sweet chocolate dessert. Semi, I'm sorry. Yeah, semi-sweet. So it had some bitterness to it. And I'm not a big fan of semi-sweet chocolate. Um, unless it's baked into my chocolate chip cookies, y'all. So I wasn't her biggest fan of her dessert, but I loved mine. But overall, Slate was our second favorite of our Magical Dining. We have two more that we're going to go to, and I am so excited. Um, Paddlefish is our next one, and we're super excited about that one. We haven't been there since they've redone it and reopened it, um, so we're really looking forward to it. But overall, Slate is a must-visit again um, with Blue Zoo. Highly recommend it. The price point was average for, for a nice restaurant. Um, by far, we walked out of this one with our cheapest bill because um, we st stuck more to the the dining plan instead of you know getting um, both of us getting drinks and then both of us getting a different appetizer off of the main menu. So by far, we were able to keep it into that magical dining price, um, and we will go back to Slate. Um, so far, Blue Zoo still number one, Slate's second, um, and then STK is running into third. So, thanks for watching. I hope you enjoyed this video. As always, remember to shine.